Alright guys, welcome back to Demon Souls. As you can see, we're just starting off from where we fought the last boss fight because I did a lot of off-screen leveling. Because um, episodes 8, 9, and 10 were all recorded on the same day, just very, you know, one after the other. And instead of just, you know, recording after that and just, you know, having episodes ready beforehand, I just figured, you know, jump off screen, do a little bit of soul farming, and, you know, went into soul form for a bit, helped out other players, you know, just because, well, I appreciate it when other people help me out, so why not? Um, speaking of, it'd be nice to see, <laughs> yeah, you can hear the dragon god here, and that's going to be our next uh, part. Um, this boss is actually kind of more of like a time it's all about timing is what it is it's really more of like a puzzle fight than your average kind of more generic boss battle so I'm just gonna, what we're gonna do here real quick is we're gonna oh, excuse me little lizard friend if you're in my way I'm just gonna kill you cuz I like your shit bro I like your shit and then there's going to be a weapon over here we're going to want to get. Got to smash through. Oh, no, we got to get him to see that we're over here so that way he kind of... Come on. Come on. I'm over here, stupid. You know, you have my grandmother's eyesight. There you go. Well, nope. Yeah, you'll know if he notices you, because his eyes will turn red. But, um, yeah, there's a weapon over there I definitely want to get, because it's OP as fuck. Come on. There we go, he saw me. Just, how do you not? Whatever. Um, we'll just start clearing off some shit over here, because this is technically the way you want to go. Okay, now. Now, sir, if you look over to your left, you can see a tiny midget man wanting you to try and hit him. Which you are apparently too incompetent to do. Because um, we can't break this ourselves. There's just no way. We need him to be all smashy crashy. So, sir. Yep. There you go. Now look over here. Peekaboo! I see you! It's like... Pulling teeth. Come on. It's like he's not even trying it. There we go! Oh, does he see me? Do you still see me? Hello? Hello? Oh, this is just embarrassing now. Because we need him to smash that so we can get this really awesome weapon. Come on. Right here. I'm here for you. You are looking right at me. We are making direct eye contact as if we were making sweet, sweet love. Whatever. Okay, we're just going to move forward. I'm not going to keep wasting time on this. You missed. Na 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 boo boo. You can't touch me because you're not my therapist. touch this inappropriately. Yeah, we got a nice full palm squeeze on that shit, didn't we? Glowing booby attack! My pelvic thrust compels you. Touch 
Ta-da! And then that kind of gives you some time to just figure out where you got to go next, which I believe is right down there. But I want to see if that damn wall opened up yet. No? Fucking seriously. It's redunculous. Redunculous, I say. I call a kangaroo court. So, whatever. We'll just keep going. A little pissed off, but we'll keep going. Let's see here. Stone of Imperial Eyes. Pretty much our favorite thing ever, right? 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 I'll shut your face. I am the last Dragon King. You know, I'm really not even worried if he sees me or not. If you were to hit me, it'd just be a compliment right now. Smooth. Ooh. Well, thank you, sir. Nice to know you finally fucking noticed me. Oh. It hurts, mommy. It hurts like fire. Okay. No, no, no. Hey, what's that over there? It's a distraction. Good job. Nee, 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 you are stupid. You know, whatever. I mean, I'm not even worried about the sword anymore because I'm pretty sure I can just beast through the game without it. It's just kind of one of those things that it's just nice to have. It's okay. When I go back to the land of the flying stingrays, we'll get a pretty badass weapon there. Oh, look, another lizard! This is what all those episodes of Steve Irwin was about when I was a kid. Yeah, yeah. Excuse me, you ready to get nailed? Oh yeah? Oh fuck yeah! Oh god, it hurts so good! It burns so fierce! Oh, look how happy he is. You know, I mean, for some reason this kind of reminds me of playing Shadow of the Colossus. I mean, not for the fact that he looks sweet and innocent, because he definitely doesn't. I mean, you can tell he's evil. But, you know, at the same time, it's kind of like I feel like I'm taking extreme advantage, you know? But then again, if you actually make it past Vanguard in the fucking, um tutorial dragon god does come to rape your shit it's literally guaranteed no matter what you do let's see I think we go up here I, I can't remember because I feel like I want to go up to his face and just knock the shit out of him but I can't figure out where I gotta dive to Ah, oh, there we go. For some reason, the boundaries wouldn't let me do it before, but now we can. You got some really vile breath there, good sir. God, this is... Yeah, this is what makes it sad, though, because it's like he... He has no real way to fight back other than just breathing on you. Oh. Put me down as a Beatles song because I actually have some sympathy for the devil here. You know, I'm, I'm just gonna try to make this quicker just to get him out of his goddamn misery, you know? Fuck. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, let's back up for a minute ok 
Can't wait for the fumes to go away. And he is done. Oh, okay, so that's how you beat the uh, dragon guy, you guys. Hit that. You know I'm gonna hit that, hit that. Damn. Well, definitely plenty of souls to be obtained here. So, what I'm going to do real quick is see if, just maybe if, the wall has finally gotten destroyed. Which, again, I'm not gonna hold hope or a prayer on it's just I want to see and then what I'll do afterwards is I'll show you guys the um okay no I can't get it anyways so I'll show you guys the shortcut I took to get down to these bosses but um I'll just kind of skip forward for that you know I'm not gonna make you watch me go through every little detail of killing all the minions in the way because honestly, I was going to show you guys that the first time around, but I didn't feel like killing all the mole people first. Like, I just kind of ran past them, and they were just chasing me so relentlessly that I didn't really have enough time to just hit record, you know. So, either way, let me skip ahead real quick, and I'll jump into showing you guys just how to get down here quicker, get to these bosses. And also, I'll show you... Uh, a little extra part of this level that I haven't done yet so I'll see you guys in a minute go get some snacks perhaps a carbonated soda I hope they have ices I've chosen the large tub my nipples look like milk duds I've got some yellow liquid for your popcorn, and it's non-dairy. Alright guys, now I'm going to show you that shortcut. As you can see, I cleared out all of the mole people on the first part here, because there's really no way to get through there without pissing all of them off. So what you want to do is get all these out of the way, and switch the axe just to make it quicker. Um, yeah, you just basically got to watch your step on all these, you know, you can look down and see where all the platforms are you know it's not really as complicated as you would think it's just because of you know the darkness settings of the game do make it somewhat difficult um, okay yeah here we go yeah it'll take a little fall damage but that's okay um, yeah as you can see that's the cavern over there that we're gonna go to and I'll show you what's over there Unless I mess up. Because <laughs> what we want to do is get on... Well, I suppose... Yeah, we can, we can get on over here. And then there will be an NPC that we talk to. And you know, it will give us a little side quest. Which you guys are free to do. Um, I don't know if I'll go through it or not. Oh, you nearly frightened me to death. Creeping up on me like that. Sorry. My name is Scurva. Treasures of the unknown. I'll show you some treasures. Impressed you've come this far. Were you guided by a sixth sense or a brash imprudent? Either way, you've more skill than I. I was guided by the voices of my head. Skill to work. There is a temple beyond here, below the ground. And that's referring to it where those bosses were. Molded by the ancient barrow as a precaution. A broad sword which can cr crush bone and slay dragon is stored in the temple. Truth told. It is the laughing stock of many a swordsmith. They say See, now he's referring to that sword that I was trying to get while fighting uh, the dragon god. A blade meant to slay a dragon. I would search for it myself. If you happen to come upon the sword, please, this, the bones of dragon... Yeah, so I don't need to hear anything else, but yeah. Um, you know, I wonder if talking to him will actually make a difference and maybe clear the path. I mean, I totally doubt it, 
but anyways so back on to our little yeah there, as you can see there's a little platform right there that we're going to want to get on to and the next one is right there I mean you can pretty much take this down however you want to I just I like to play it safe and actually make sure I know where I'm going otherwise that happens so <laughs> I'm gonna go get my souls back and then we'll check out the sword I'll see you guys in a minute alright guys so I just decided to just skip straight to the flame lurkers um, little area here uh, first things first I'm gonna go try to get my souls back I'm not even going to um, <laughs> not even gonna bother um, getting out of soul form right now I'm not gonna use any of the Imperial eyes just yet because you never know if I'll I might die um, as you can see from all these fucking worms. I'm going the wrong way uh, I should get a Side tunnel here Okay, um Can't see shit It's just fucking It's official you suck Okay Well, obviously there's no point in going back to get those souls because they are gone now that is my epic failure of the day and I'm just <laughs> I'm gonna leave off on that I'll see you guys next time <laughs>